need that for air to air the bed. Yeah. Okay, I, what I did is I got the jack out there, and I got boards, so after we get it up over the thing, we can jack it up, set the center of the tire on them ones. Yeah. And the back ones, we're gonna put on them ones on either side. That gives us that much. I'm gonna put a couple small pieces under the lift. Alrighty. Alrighty, welcome back. I'm your man, Bad Chad, and got Nathan in the house, and Queen Jolene's on the camera. We are on air. We finally got the switch put in the, in the hoist. Um, we've got the modifications on the Bugatti that we need to get done. We didn't actually complete it, but we cut some of the square stock that we needed to fit it back on. When we tried it last time, it did not fit whatsoever. We, we damaged the, the chassis a couple places, but that's okay. Um, we're in a place where we're trying to put it together where it's never been. Um, now we're gonna do it again. Uh, if Joey wants to take a look right here, um, on this piece, you can see that square stock, I cut that out. Um, but you can see over on the other square stock where I put a piece in. So I've actually added and taken away. So I took a piece of um, probably 3 16 plate, welded it on the back side of the square stock, and then I cut the front of the square stock out so we can go maybe get down on. We're gonna, now we're gonna see what happens. We're gonna take the hood off. We gotta lift the front, pull it out from the back. Where do you want to go with that? I'll set that anywhere. So. You got it? Yeah. Heavy, isn't it? Not bad. <laughs> Not bad, he says. <laughs> All right. We got Nathan in the house to help me do this. And uh, that's why we're doing it. Um, I think I'll just leave that right on there. We it doesn't matter. You want to take the front and I'll push the back? We still got the vice grips here to... Yep. Okay. Rocking and rolling. Here comes that bump here in a second. Okay. Keep your fingers crossed, everybody. It works. Come on, keep your fingers crossed. Give us a, give us a big hell yeah. All right, where are we? I'm hoping it fits, where? I can tell you that. I don't know what's shaking, but. Oh, the gas tank shaking? Because I didn't know I put anything in it to shake. But yeah, that shakes. Let's take this out of it. We don't need the, well, it don't matter if it stays there or not. Yeah, we gotta remember, we had these shoved in all the way last time. Okay. I think so. Put my shoe back on. Had them in all the way. Push in. We're going, oh yeah. We're going to that point where. We're gonna put blocks of wood on them too, I think. Two by four, two by four, two. Ouch. Okay, I got four pieces. Hopefully we can go with two pieces. My old foot without my boots on is not very tough. What do you got, your little dancing shoes on? Yeah, I got my dancing shoes on. Yeah. Getting into that Plymouth is hard, so I put the sneakers on and get in and out of it better. All right. So put, hopefully that clears the lip this time. Working on the railroad. I don't work on the railroad, but I pretend. I pretend. Is that going to get over where you want it, Nathan? Well, I think the back might have to go over. Again. That there will work just fine. Leroy. Okay. I think the back's going to come this way a little bit. Which I can push can it that do. way a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit to get past that. Okay. That moved the front too, probably no doubt in my mind. Yeah. That back was tight on that lip, wasn't it? And up here we went up on this corner. corner. I like that. Part. Yeah, because you said this piece here has to go down by the frame, right? It does. It has to go down by yeah. the frame. So we can lift the hoist up some and then readjust these. Okay. If you want to work the hoist, I'll do the And you want this on that tubing there. So this might have to be, you wanted this on this tubing right here at the edge. Yeah. Yeah. Guess we'll go up just a little bit and then yeah. re -situate. We got quite a ways to go, actually, but. Yeah, well, we, we want to do that because last time we couldn't get down on a frame far enough. You're the man for that. I remembered that last time. I remembered it didn't fit. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you got her. How close? 
Looking good. Looking good here. Oh, just a second, just a second. I'll go and see that piece of wood on the other side. Up here. That's when we'll toss that piece of frame, I guess. I'm scurrying around like an eight-year-old boy. Scurrying. Oh, you know how that goes. Yep. How's yours? Yeah, looks better. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna make sure it's gonna clear them sills and the fenders with that hoist. Do we have enough? Yeah. To clear? Just go just a little so. bit. I'd be quick on this one. You got her. You're going up. You're good. Yeah, but it's going to hit the fender here, isn't it? The bottom of the fender with the hoist. Hey. See what I'm saying? Oh, I see. See, I would have bent the fender already. Damn it. It's awful close. Just need a piece of wood. I got two pieces. Got to come of back wood. down a little bit. Just a thinner piece. I got two pieces of wood here. Bye. Okay. I think the back's going to be okay. It's just the back's front. going to be okay. I think one thin piece on each front corner. Here. Good thing you noticed that. I would have hum daddied on that and bent the fenders. Okay, let's try her again. I'm Freddie Fender's cousin. Bent fender. Ready? It's touching. So you're good on this side. You're good on that. I think you're going to be okay. Yeah, I'm good on this. All yeah, right. looks like you're going to be okay. This is here. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. Butt crack. That's annoying when that doesn't work. But. Second here. Oh. I'm gonna... some humming. She's not. That's how the hoist is working. Just like I'm dancing. That pump keeps air rating for some reason. Should that, should that be good enough or? That should be good, shouldn't it? That thing keeps the... aerating. What's that? That pump keeps aerating. Aerating? Aerating the fluid. That's how we pulled it back in last time. Said so to put a little strap on it. Oh, we didn't lengthen the air lines out, did we? No. Oh well. I wonder. Can then be? Sh Do you have another piece of line? You stick on there right quick. Do you have any more line? For like how we mean this line, then we can just lengthen that one out so it's longer. So we'll have to unhook it and hook it back up again under the car. Now you're asking for lots. Just saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know what you're saying. Mm -hmm. I'm going to say no. And I might have, but I'm just going to say no. Just Probably so you... up on Elvis or something. Just that one airline back there. Yeah, we can buy that. Yeah. Now getting this thing centered up and on them blocks of wood's going to be the next thing. Can't tell until you get underneath here, can you? Huh? No, you can't get at all. All the brow, the mounts are still on. What's the front end doing for side to side? Oh, we had to jack up stick them blocks underneath it. The the frame? We had to jack the frame up, put them blocks under the wheels. That's going to be hard to do, eh? To... If you know what I mean, it's going to be hard to do, sort of. Um, why don't we bring it down, get it sort of in place, then jack it up? Yeah. What do you think? Yep. Or does that yep. make sense? Yep. Tell we me. are totally not in center yet, so 
Which way we gonna go, back or front, buddy? Let's go, let's go turn her over. I can get her over this way. Just trying to center that motor up some, eh? Do we want to come forward or do we want to do go backwards and do it instead of going over the hump? Well, what do you want to do? I think the back end's just got to come over. We want to just lift it. Make it easy. I don't know how easy it is. Tell me when you go. One, two. Oh, right there. Yeah. Now we had to bring this roll to head and turn it straight in the up. Roll back. Looks nice. That don't look too bad, Nathan. Yeah. That don't look too bad, old buddy. Oh, it's gonna come ahead. Yeah. Here somewhere. I'll we'll just go down and try it or what? Yeah, we'll just go down and try it for a bit and see how close we get, and then then we'll go from there. Is this thing gonna jump and go on? Don't know. I don't know. He says. There's no guarantees. <laughs> <laughs> I like. Mm -hmm. Awesome. There's no guarantees, he says. And we're working on a Bugatti, and there's no guarantees. <laughs> That's why I tell Jolene, there's no guarantees. Looking good. I've got a while to... All right, your ass end is way over too far on... We pulled it over too far. Got to pull that ass end over this way a little bit. Back this way. I'll try to pull a second. Oh. One, two seconds. Ready? One, two. Yeah. More or enough? I don't know. It's going to hit your tires. It's going to hit both of our tires by the looks things. We're not, but we're not back far enough by no by, by no means, are we? So we did huh? that firewall. Yep. Oh. Well, yeah. we're close. All right. It just looks are deceiving, I guess. All right, we're gonna hit the tires, are we? Not on this side. Uh, the, the hoist is, I think. Yep, the hoist right. is gonna hit the tire. <sighs> Maybe that'll shove it right back in place where the hoist hits, because it's gotta come back, hasn't it? Um, oh yeah, it's gotta come back. We should have had the hoist things the other way. Right there somewhere, okay. probably. I don't know, Nathan. Let's try. Let's let's go down for a little ways and see what happens. We got how long? How far we got? Oh, we got a little ways. I'm just gonna go slow. And try. All right, go for it. Oh, we didn't change that oil, that dipstick. That I, I pulled it ahead. Okay. Yep, I zip tied it ahead to the header. Okay. You're you're the man. You're on it. That's what oh, I was doing uh, while you were cutting. I'm going to stay stop for a second. So that goes up behind here, don't it? That goes up. That goes up past that. So after it goes down. So what are you thinking? What am I thinking? I'm thinking that the it's got to come over just a bit. I'm gonna get the jack. I got the jacks already here. I got it. All right. I think jack. I got to pull the front end over a little bit. I brought the jack over. Where are you gonna go with it? I'm just gonna pull it over this way, I think. Like it's like, okay, you know what I mean? Yep. Oh. What? You want Boy, you just got brownie points from Jolene there, mister. Well, she just went and got it. She had it. Oh, she got it. Yeah. She was thinking. She's thinking. Is that how that goes? Oh. I see the airbags. Yeah, keep working. putting pressure. Okay. Yeah. A second. Yep. Let's see. How much more? We're not far off now, buddy. There Oop. it goes. There we go. Looks like that looks, that looks pretty good now. Yeah, we probably could come back a bit. <laughs> Try it there. Is that part there now? That might go. I can come ahead some, can it not? I'm gonna let it down. 
never even thought about. Don't look we're bad. against the hoist arm right there, so when we come ahead that far. So, is it ready to come down or? I think so. It's not going to hit on that. I think you're good there. Oh, that's some, going to be some close to that chassis on that side. on that side. I think the rear end's got to come over this way come a little bit. Come back this way. Yeah, over this way, just a little bit. Uh, how are we going to do that now? A second. I guarantee you a little bit. Tell me when you're ready. Let's see if I can pick it up a little bit. Well, we'll try. I'll start to shove when you get ready. Yeah. Right. One, two. It ain't happening. Huh? Did it go in? Yeah. Probably have to... Jack? No, I have to pull over a little bit. Well, why don't we pull Grab the car. Is it going to miss your jack now? Is your Let's just take the car. The car will slide on the hoist easy enough on them pieces if we just... Here, I can pull on this wheel a little tiny bit. You want to push it that way? Ready? Yeah. There we go. Yep. We don't want to go too far. Too far, huh? No, I just said we don't oh. want to. I think you're going down by there. Boy, that's close. I think we go wow. down a little farther to... Huh? We'll go down further to see. Let's, yeah, let's let her down some. Is, it, is the hoist going to hit the tires? Not right now, nope. We're over there too far in the... All right. It, what about the... Do I need to come ahead with the... Whoop, 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 whoop. We're going to hit that oil sending unit. Yeah, that needs to move. And we need to... Yeah, the engine needs, needs to come ahead some. Needs to come ahead. Just to come ahead a little bit. See, it can't because it's hitting okay. the there. Try that now. And it's going to hit something, ain't it? It's going to hit that. And it's hitting the hoist? Yeah. We put them pads. Should have been the other the head farther. That's what we did last time. And we can do that here, just just over here. And um, pull this, lift up on one corner and push the pad ahead a little bit. That's all we're going to do. Just a second. What we're going to do is this ain't very... If we, Pull this and just shove this ahead a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Same on the other side. Does that hit going towards the frame now? Doesn't change much there, does it? A little bit? Yeah, she's pretty. What is it? Have to cut the end off the hoist. Well, this one here, so this here could go in. This here, if it does go in, it can go in about three inches on this one. That's the one that's tighter. So is it hitting the tire? This one here, we can go in some. Just. We could go more on that one too if we have to. Huh? Is that one good still? Well, it's going to hit the frame when it comes down. Right here? It's no, not there. The end of the hoist is going to hit the frame. Or it looks like it's going to. Why does everything have to be so close? Okay, now we can go back. All right. That'll, just, cha that'll change a little bit of everything. Uh, cut my head off and get down in there. Yeah, don't put your head in there. Can you, Joey, watch? Oh, just a second. Am I head far enough of my? Yep, it's a head here far enough to go by. Okay. The hoist is getting some close to the chassis in the back. In the front. This side here still got an inch or so that it can go. Buy it there. Not gonna hit the chassis? Not till it's almost all the way down. This one here. It's gonna hit. This one here might this one here might go in a little bit further. That's oh, something close. That's close. How do we wanna do that? What we got? Let's bring this one back another half, we half an inch on our where we shoved it ahead. Let's just bring this one back a little bit. So we want to pick up? Just pick it up and we'll bring it back a little bit. There, that was as much as that now. That's more. I can get my hand up between the two of them. You can get your hand between it. 
<laughs> yeah, it'll go down a ways. Take it down till it almost. Yeah, right. might as well take it down a little bit. All right, let's let's whoa, let's stop it there for a second. Roll it back up against the heads there. Don't tank it. Don't let it down at all, because it's. Yep. You want to put a block gallons. behind that tire? Put a block behind. It. So don't roll back. We could actually jack the. the there. Car. There's better. Can't see. Oh, that might. Yeah, it's gonna clear it in the back. Yeah, it's gonna clear it, but it's gonna be close. Holy. Oh yeah, it's gonna be close. Holy. I say we go down still some more. Nah, I would say this side's gonna hit. This one? This yeah. is still got room there. On that hoist? Yep. On the side still, of that frame? Yep, right there. Still got room. <laughs> it's got a finger width in there. Right there. It's right close. Oh my. I guess that's close. Oh my. Can that be shoved in at all if I pick that up? Can you pull that in there? Because I know that was quite loose that side. Okay. Pull that in at all? Oh, I roll back a touch more. Here, just. Okay, right there. Try right there. There, that brought it better, but a little closer to the tire, but it's more closer away from the frame. That one's going to miss the frame, but it's going to hit it when it comes down for too far. I wonder if we should start jacking the, the chassis up. We hit it down further last time. Okay, let's do it then. Sack, I got to make sure these oil galleries aren't hitting. Okay, well, not hitting? That block would. Probably you come ahead a little a bit there. Eh? inches there. Come ahead there, try that. Try that. Come down. All right, just a second, I gotta take a look. <laughs> I wanna say put it down on, but that's not what's happening here. We've got, yeah, a good, a good gap on that side. Good gap on that side. Ah, we're gonna hit on this side, I think. Now we're down by it. We're going by it, but we're gonna hit on the, on the flange. You know what I mean? So how much room do you get back to the tire? Can we swing it back towards the tire to pull it away from that a little bit? We're off. It's like paper, paper thin. It should go. <laughs> we're gonna hit that flange is what we're gonna do. Well, this 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 can can be pulled in, can it? No, that's all the way in. I think. Here, I'll lift it up and you try. Mm. Hey, hey, son of a. How much space do you got here, Chad? To the tire. You can so if you swing this back, that little half, little bit there, we might be able to. It might go by. You might get to pull your button yeah. and we'll swing it back. Well, it hits a tire. There you go. There, that gives you a little more in there. Gives me a little. Yeah, it doesn't go bound down by that thing. Got something right high. We're kind of, the body's kind of. We must have had the arms swing, swung back a little farther last time. Like the whole body must have been back farther on the hoist. The hoist, the car must have been back this way farther on the hoist, the shell. And then it would have turned that arm away from the frame more. So it must have did last time. That, the shell, it must have been back farther, which would have brought that arm out from it farther. Okay. Um, how are we going to deal with that? Uh, That looks, we're going to hit on, we're, we're way over on one side up front here. If I pull it over, it's a big mistake because it's going to come off that. The, the front end of it's got to come over this way. The back is going to be close here too. Black going close. It's not going to go down past that lip where it's setting. What, what if, um, I'm kind of wondering if we took it off the hoist and set it down on. You know what I mean? Leave the back, set the front on. We can pick this front up and set it down on. 
swing the arms out and swing the arms out on the front let the front down on then we'll take the jack and do the back yeah put the jack under the body and lift all right so up. i'm gonna if i i can hold this front end if you want to pull the arms out in the front it's gonna drop a, well drop a head far enough okay you yep, know what i'm saying try it we'll yep. try it yeah what the heck you whatever you want to do yeah ready yep So I guess we're going on no matter what. Yeah. Right now, it's all yours. Is it going to hit the back of the engine there, Nate? Not right away. No, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Whoop! Well, now it's getting ready to touch back can in. You, can you go ahead a little bit with the end, with the frame? Just pull the frame forward a little bit. It's going to hit the hoist in the back. It's hitting the hoist. All right, there we oh. go. Am I hitting the engine? No. Uh, actually. Yeah, yeah, that's the oil. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna come ahead just a hair, but we're hitting the hoist arm in the back, Chad. Okay, try it there a little bit. Am I gonna still hitting that bolt in the back of the head sweeter? Yeah. yeah, it's gonna set right on the bolts right now. All right, let's um. Here, won't we put the jack on where your hands are, and then you can let off it. And it's probably hitting the mirror hoses in the front too that we didn't unhook. <laughs> There, so set on that. Hope that don't shouldn't go anywhere on nope. my back. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So now we don't want that on them on them oil galleries. Woo. So if we lift leave that on there and lift the hoist up just we'll a little bit. Put this on jack stands in the back. Lift the back end up, put it on jack stands. Yep. I don't know what to say, like it's kind of it's hitting the hoist arms in the back right now. We can't go forward. Is that what's going on? If we lift the back up. And you'd never get that off. Then the frame, you'll never get the, the arms out because you'd have to roll it back. You know. If we lift the body up on the jack stand. And then if you had an inch play in the front, we could get them arms down to the ground. And then it would probably not even come out. So, what, what, so you want me to pick the back of it up and push the arms ahead a little bit? Because we're not putting it down on. Right? <laughs> we just don't want to hit the frame, that's all. You know what I mean? That freaking lip on the bottom of the frame. If I pick this up, am, uh, can uh, we pull that ahead without hitting the frame? No, it's going to hit the frame more as soon as you pull the arm ahead. we got to take the back tires off. Oh, no. No. Oh, I think we're going to... We should have had that body back further. You see? Yeah, if we'd have had these if we would have had these arms back this way further, then it would have been farther out. We had the body ahead too far this time. Last time we had the body back further. In the frame, everything was back a little farther from the hoist. Last time. That's what we did. Um, da, 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 da. I don't want to rest it on them bolts. And we can't pull, can we pull the body ahead a little bit on them, on them? Can I pull the body ahead a little bit on the, on the, on well, the wood? We, we can pull the body ahead on okay. the wood aways by about four inches if we had to. Okay, well I'm going to pull the body for it. But we no. can't because of the motor, Can right? I push the body back? That's what I need yeah, to do. Yeah, the body can go back. Okay. Yep, the body can go back. Let's go on. Here, I'll give you a little tug if you want. Just tell me if I'm by these bolts up front. By which bolts up front? Oh, them head bolts. Them. Yep, we're just about by them there, yep. Yeah, we're by them there enough that it would go down by. Okay. Let's pull the jack out. We'll just let the jack down a little bit. Yeah, okay. You let don't, it just down. leave your, you don't even have to hold it with your hands. Oh, do we have to do with the air? Do we have to mess airline. with the air? Remember? Do we have to mess with the airline? Yeah. Now we got the jack under the body, so the frame is going to go down lower. We lift that airline off, is that what it's going to do? Yeah. It's going to do it. Uh, do. Damn it. Now we can go back. That won't rip that off. Remember, we put it down here. It ain't long enough. When you put one down, the other side's going to go down too, right? Just a second. See? Put one down. The other side has to go down. That'll work, won't it? That's the one. No. Because there's the body mount. It's going to be right down. And it's going to rip it off, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, 
All right. Um, well, we put a jack stand over there and take the airline off it. We get the jack <laughs> under the front. Oh, Jesus. Um, the body will go down as soon as we pull the air out, or the frame will go down. The frame is going to drop. So we block the frame and leave it where it is. I'm going to get a jack stand. Yeah. Hopefully, the jack stand fits on the front of it. Should have known. Look at that now, would you? Okay, put the jack under here and we'll put the car jack under there. Okay, suppose. Um, put the jack under this one. Jack stick yeah. under this. I don't want to bend that. I don't want to bend that. Um, You're going to have to. I have to get this out of the way. I'm gonna hold the body. Okay, I'll grab the jack stand. Yep. There we go. Then we're gonna undo, put this under there and then undo the ear line. Oh yeah, we're past it now. A little touchy poo there, that shouldn't hurt that any. One side, one side of this here. We're gonna need the air again, are we not? Well, unless you want to leave it right on the jack. Like, can we leave it on the jack, or I'll probably leave the frame on the jack, and then I suppose it don't matter, does it? It's up to you. Okay. How's that gonna work? How are we doing that now? Up over that. It's gonna go up over that frame across me that you welded there. Pull my pants up before I get in there. Up over here. That's something that has to be fixed. Yeah, I can't keep doing that every time. No, I don't want to keep doing that. And we can pump that up after we get yep. it down on. Yeah. All right. So now, now I'm going to pull the jack stand and let it down. Yeah, we can set set it down the jack stand a little bit more. Yep. Yeah. I must set it down right on the chassis, didn't I? We'll set it down the jack stand here first, see what it hits. Oh, we're going down on. The jack stand is set there. Almost... Yes, yeah, this one, you're just barely touching this one. Close is. Too close. Second, go ahead. Too close? I can't bring the car head in either because it's hitting the hoist. Okay, I, just, I think you just cleared it. Yeah. Now we're caught up on body fill. Probably. Or it's got to come ahead just a little bit further. The hoist is holding the car from coming ahead too with the wheels. Once the hoist was down all the way, then it would wheel ahead further. Can I bring the car ahead some? We can't because it's hitting the hoist arms. No, the body. Can I wiggle the body head a the little bit? The body's already hitting the back of the head. Now we're on top of the head bolts again. Ah. So I mean, you got to come back again, the body down, right there. Yeah. Ah, just rub them by right there. We don't know which arms are freaking us off. There's right there on the, the mount fell off on this side. Ugh. It's holding up on, I would say, the end caps that I welded on there. I want to put that on that mount. So you know, I get that. There's a hole there underneath. I think we're holding up on filler. Like that hoist arm is frigging us up against the tire in the back. We can't move. It's not hitting though, is it? Yeah, it's hit the tire. We can't move the tire. Okay, but the frame. We're on that bolt. That's got to come ahead. The body's got to go back. The body's got to go back a little bit. I mean, but it's hitting on that. On the. I've got enough cut out there. That looks good. By geez, that looks good. Them caps I think on. if I shoved down on it, we'd have it. Yep, you want to take, take that jack stand out? They're by there right now. We'll just let it down a couple more clicks then. It's going down by, it's just rubbing. Yep, we're scraping paint is what we're doing. Yep. See how that body mount's clipped? We're on the front. We gotta let the back down now is what we could do. 
So when the back... When the back goes down, it'll come away from the motor. It will. Right, when the back goes down, it'll come away from the motor. Well, we're on but the front. We got to... We tore the paint up the front up here a little bit, but I think that's the problem. It's on too much of paint. But that's part of the job. So if I lift that up... We got to get them hoist We're arms. not going to get the hoist arms out, are we? If we can get them to go down by the frame... We could roll it back. Huh? Yeah, the front's on. We could roll it back. Okay, that's what we do. I'll pick the back up. Pick the body up and then roll it back. But then the hoist... We can, we can only go back... If we go back... We can go back three inches on them frame brackets. So... So can I roll it back now? Just uh, hold the body and we'll, and we'll roll okay. it back. Okay, and taking this out. Yep. Hold the body. Lift the body up a little bit and I'll roll it back on this bracket I can see there, yep. Okay. Tell me when you're ready. Yep. Oh, I don't know. Uh, uh, just a second. Yep. <laughs> I don't know about that. Um, I, I might want to take the jack and put it underneath the back, if you know what I'm saying. Pump the air hoses up. And yeah. Good job, Fina. Yeah. Somebody's here. The mounts are on the front, just like it's the not hitting. And they're pretty lo looking good. It looks like it's going to hit over there. So it looks like the body's got to go that way. I should be able to let that down now, shouldn't I? Now? I want to, don't I want to take that up and get this out, don't I? Yeah. Yep. I'll take that in. <laughs> what? It's tr it's life, man. Yep. It's true. Sure. Julia, I just want you to know that. What am I going to let you know? Well, the front's know? down by. Yes, but we're close over here. See, that, that's nice. Yeah, we got to get the back. The back's going to come away from the motor when it comes down. I'm telling you one thing. I'm not looking for this thing going off and on a bunch of times. I can tell you that. I want to put a piece of wood on that, too. I get a piece of wood. Yeah, I'm not looking forward to that. I'm doing that a bunch of times. Taking it up and down. Just a couple of them short from zero, whatever. It's right on the square tubing. I'm not looking forward to going spin a little bit, yeah. That ain't gonna do it. Oh yeah. Perfect. There you go. So I'll push on the wheel a little bit and you pull on the uh Okay, just a second. I come back. We'll come back more yet. Just a minute now. I want to see if it's hitting on this side. Or getting. Uh, I got like three or four inches on this side. It can go back. Then we yeah. Can... I'm just wondering about the hoist hitting the frame. That's all. Well, once. Yeah, are I you, still got over you, an inch there. Are you ready? Yep. Okay. Well, second. I still got uh, still got lots here. Go a little more. Uh, I, I, get, I, get, I get I get I get I get got a couple fingers there. Yeah, I can get my fingers in there. No problem. Are we coming back still? Back. Yep. Okay, just a second. See, as we go back, the hoist is coming out, right? Right. That's over here. The hoist will probably go by now. Do we want to let it down? Well, that's what we're going to do if that hoist is. Ah, that's what we're going to do, he says. That's what we're going to do. The side will go down by if you want okay. to. Okay. Bolts are through there. Boys, it's... Look, it's... It's going to come away from the... Yeah, middle. yeah. If you want to let it down slowly. Well, we got to take the jack out of here. Oh, just a sec. We're up against the body. Jack it up. Block would come out, did it? Uh huh? Just a sec. The wood is out. I must have pushed the wood out. It's not on the wood no more. It's not even on the jack on this side. Okay. Oh, we okay. must have pushed it out. Here, I'll jack it up a little more. Hey, hey, I want to bring that out. 
my side still on, just barely on the wood there. Just pull it back some more? Just a second, just a second. How about we just let the hoist down? Well, just a little saying, bit. As long as it's past the frame, it can yeah, get down. Yeah, just a little bit. But we... Try that. Whoa. If I get it away from the frame, it'll go by, I can let it down past. Uh, we're going to have to pull it back more from this side. Back more? Is yeah. it touching the frame now? Well, just it's, it's off. Like, everything's off. Is the hoist touching the frame now? No. It's, it's let go of all the wood out of it and everything. I'm yep. trying to pull it out. How's you? How are you? Well, I'm, I'm away from the frame far enough. The hoist will go down by, is what I'm saying. Okay. See what I'm saying? Yes, 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 yes. Yes, we can go down now. As long yep. as your hands can go in there, we can go down by. Yeah, we've we got no wood. No, I, I got you what you're throwing down now. I got what you're throwing down. So then I'll run the jack here nice and easy. Once get it. Now, I got an air, just a sec, I got an air line up above. It's going, nope, that's not going to hit. I don't think it's going to hit, but... Man, I seeing something nice underneath. Nice and easy. Where'd you get this car? Just a second. I'm gonna get a mount in place here. Mount in place there. You can leave her on there tonight. <laughs> what? Um. Jeez. Okay. Come, let her down some. The body's got to come ahead. We'll be able to move okay. a little. Okay, let her down some. Right, slow up for a second. Yeah, we're missing good on the chassis now. We're not quite. I think the way the body's gonna set. No, it's not. All right, we're quite a ways away from the head now. That's good, but it does seem seem like we got to go back on the front. If you want to come take a look here for a second, just so you know what's going on both ends. See how we're. We're, we got to come ahead. See that that, that mount there? Right there yeah, yeah, it's got to come ahead. So, so the good thing is now, all you got to do is hold this front of the body, and we can roll it. Roll the frame is separate, right? We should be able to roll okay. the frame. Okay, just uh, ready? Yeah. Just hold it. There, it went back some there, haven't you? More? A little bit. We're up on our rubbers, I know that. I just don't know if the rubber's in the right place or not, if you know. Well, if you line this your bolt holes up here, we'll... What I'm gonna do is... Uh... Yeah, it's gonna come ahead quick. Well, that's... Doesn't that seem like... The back is still gonna go down and go away from yeah, okay. that. Okay. The back goes okay. down. So, you just gotta pull the head. I think you let the back down more. That radiator's gonna hit on those. That radiator's gonna be leaned ahead more. And we we rolled it back some. We did that. All right, let her down some. See in the back. See, it's right, we're real close here. Yeah. We're hitting on the um, transmission. The tube is still in the way where it is? Yeah. Things got to come ahead. I got to go pry that ahead. Okay, I'll cut the zip ties and yeah. bring it ahead. I want to check the back, see what that looks like. Getting closer, sweetheart. Getting closer. How many, how long, how many years has it been? Too damn we'll, many, eh? We'll be rolling her in the shop on the frame tonight. Oh my goodness, eh? I'm going to take it back off. Well, that's not bad. The back. No, the back's going fine. Back looks good, don't it? And it's pulling away from the motor every bit we let it down. Yeah. 
fun there. Sad part is I gotta take it all back off. Well, yeah. Huh? Yeah. Jeez. You got a little bit more there. That, that, that'll that still go. If we put that down there, that'll go by. That ain't gonna... Okay. That'll keep moving as yep. we keep going. Yep. That'll keep moving as we keep going. I'll just push it ahead. Yeah. Like that'll go in there. Go down some more. Uh, how's that side, baby? On the side of the framework. Nope. Not good. See it? Where we cut that piece off that time? The stick is not the stick that we need. Transmission stick's kind of buggering us up. Don't want to bust that or bend it, I suppose, but. Oh, we're down on. She's on right now. Oh, we're on. We'll just tweak it around. <laughs> we're on. See, the red's not going to hit after we rolled that back. That's fine. That's fine. The head's fine. Should just line these here bolt holes up here now. Oh, that's only off by a little bit, Chad, on this hole. That hole's only off. Come this way a little bit on that body, man. Which which about this one here. Yeah, Should well, them, them, them got um, weed whacked and, and out of shape when I put the braces on for the fender, so they're going to have to be dealt with. She's sitting on there right now. Um, I think I want to put more air in that back tire. I want to check out the air suspension in the back. I'll blow that up. If it won't go up some. If it don't go up some, we're going to have to put a shim the airbag in the back, no doubt. Down on. I think the body's going to come ahead just a little bit more. There we go. If we come ahead a half an inch on them head bolts a little bit more, I think the front ones will line right up. Okay. But we're down over the frame here now where you did that fix. On either side there's a gap here, see? You got that gap there now, right here. That looks good, don't it? Yeah, that did that we come fix. over a little bit that way, your way, could we not? Oh, we can come this way a little more. It's still got a gap there. But if we come ahead on that mount there, look at them two mounts here, we can come ahead quarter of an inch, half an inch on this head still to get the mount bolts in. It can, we can go ahead, the body can go back? No, the body can come ahead a little bit on the frame. Okay. Right here, right? I just gotta stand back and take a look for a minute now. You wouldn't want to do that a dozen times, would you? Well, you'd maybe prepare a little bit more things. Prepare a little bit more? Man, I never get prepared. I just do it. <laughs> I think baby won't get in. Put the doors on for you. I was thinking when I built the car, the, the wheels are in there quite a ways. I'm going to have to probably put a spacer on that and bring that wheel out a little bit. I'm not sure because there's a fine tuning spot there where that wheel turns. That was nice and center. That could almost come out an inch or two. That's what I'm saying. Like we probably could bring it out just a little tiny bit. It probably needs it. You're down on, sweetheart. You want me to turn the key and start her up? The transmission stick is got to have some tweaking done. We're pretty close. We're not hitting anywhere. The cutouts that we did on on the on the square stock. What, what, you, what you see, Obra? If we bring that body ahead, that little like see the back of the head and these bolts here, that comes ahead that quarter or half an inch. That'll miss this front of that frame. Like right now, it's touching. Yeah. And that will miss it if we bring it ahead that little bit on the... Okay, we're so that mount there. what would you like to do? Put something on the front wheel, just reef on it? Yeah, yeah, if we give that body just a quick... Well, I mean, it's probably going to... As long as it don't move the mounts too much, but it might. It might. If we get that, I'll go to the back. It's only going to come ahead. It's only going to come ahead. Just like. Ready? One, two, three. Let's see. Did it come? I'll go to the back and we'll get a little shot. that tank. Just a second. Just a second. Ready? One, two. Going? Huh? Did it go in? 
to get closer. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah, now we're lining up better. Not hitting that at all now, is it? No. Now, this mount here is just... Uh, I could put a bolt right down through that one. That head's okay. still close. That's, I think that's it there, Chad. Yeah, me too. I'm not hitting anywhere. It's just, it's just hitting going down on is the problem. I'm just going to line them. Better prepared is what that... Is that what you told me? Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, even that hold up there's lined up yeah. now, too. Nathan yeah, called, that's it right there. They're lined up now. Nathan called me by my, my nickname. He didn't even know it. He said, that looks awful rink-a-dink to me. And I said, I used to have my nickname was rink-a-dink. Pissed in the kitchen sink. <laughs> Old Freddie Curry used to call me that. <laughs> rink-a-dink. Yeah. yeah. I wonder if I did piss in the kitchen sink or not. I must have had a bath and pissed in the kitchen sink, maybe. I'm oh, happy. Yeah. That's not too bad. We got a little spot right, here. Right there, I can just go like that. Let's go over the spots. We got that spot down there is looking good. Got yeah, a nice right on by, good gap Got a there. nice gap going on there. Put your finger down there again. Yep, yeah, right in there. Right, right in there. It's got a nice gap. Yeah, she's down by. That's where it's hitting before. We got, we got a spot over there. That's tight, a little bit tighter. Probably could go over just a bit. If we want to take a look down in here, if you want to, I don't know what side you want to go on, sweetheart. Uh, right here. Right here. Yep, you're in past them. Right there. See where we did that cutout? That goes in past that shock mount. That worked out fantastic. The other one worked out fantastic. That one worked out fantastic. The cutout's doing good. The engines, we got enough. There's a piece of aluminum going on the back of that firewall too. So it needs, I need, I don't know, if it's 14 gauge, so I need a little tiny bit. I don't think I hurt anything there, eh? It maybe shunned the pain a little bit. Yeah, but. But that stuff there, we got enough room for the for the aluminum. Yep. That's fitting good. Yeah, you get lots of enough room there for the aluminum piece. All right. Now we don't have to work on it for another seven years. <laughs> All right, that's good. That's now you good. can roll it and look at it. All right, roll it and look at it. Huh? Look at that, baby. Huh? I told you I'd build you a Bugatti. Thanks, Nathan. Appreciate it. I'm gonna put the hood on now. See, my, can I get put oh. the hood on? Will you bend those broad stand, those yeah, brake lines yeah, where I can, you, yeah. wherever you think they could be bent? I don't even mind the ride height of it. I think the ride height is really good. Don't you? I think we should air it out and see what it does. Yeah, we can. Yep, yeah. air it out. See what? Put the hood on it. Air it out. Yeah. Here, I'll grab one side. You grab that. Other. So you go and grab that lift and with it, right? Goes in that little hole there. If you want to air it out that front hose, we can stick that hose through the grill there. I'll hold this. Stick your hose through the grill and then we can. Yeah. Good. Right. So you gotta go in a little bit? Just a little bit. Okay. Look at that now, would you? You want to air it out? And see what it I, I do sort of want to air it out, just to see. Maybe that can be tomorrow, but no problem. Want to air it out? All right, Nathan. I wonder if the chassis is going to hit the ground. What's going to hit? All right, you air the front out, Nathan, and I'll take. I'm just going to air it completely out. She's going to go down. Yeah. I'm going to get this off here. Because she's close, I'll tell you. I can't go down far, like four inches maybe tops. Maybe I ain't going to hit it here. You rock. enough room for that hoist. You pretty well got her there. Perfect. How's the not back? Hitting, not hitting the ground, but, but, but an inch. Is the back hose exhaust. hard to get at? Huh? Is the back hose hard to get at? Nope, that's right, that's right there. That thing's bad. Oh, there it is. Oh, oh it's hitting the, that's why it's hitting the fender. Nope. Just cut, just cut, just cut. Hi. Just a second, I'm just seeing it hitting the fender. No, this one's got a gap in the fender. That one's good. That one, this one here, this wheel here, is kind of... I'd say there she oh, is. She's on the ground. We got, we got exhaust on the ground now. We had an air dude up there in the... Just we, might, we might want to take it up, the exhaust. 
It's hit, but that's it. All right. Is it? I think it's fine. Huh? It's fine. The exhaust is on the ground, but it's 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 not hurting anything. Let's see. We had aired it up. Had the motor and frame aired it up there, didn't we? That looks good, don't it, baby? Huh? Huh? That looks <laughs> sick. That's sick, I think. What do you think? You don't like it, Airdo? All right. Oh, you don't like it, Airdo? It's crazy. I mean, like, how, how, that's crazy. You know what I mean? Crazy. Good. Let's take it out and see. Here you go. go. She's on the. Huh? Jeez, you look at that. You fall into the engine. Oh, I'll just head down a second. Ago. It did, yeah. Just a little tiny bit. That's cool. A little more tweaking than you'll have. Don't get her too high in the front. You should look like a full drive. Might put a shim in the back, maybe. Put a shim in the back. Get it up just a little bit higher. But that was amazing. It was really good. It was awesome. All right, everybody. Thanks a lot for coming back. I appreciate it. Jolie's Bugatti's on the chassis. We didn't, I'm going to say, I don't think we caused any damage, uh, to be honest with you, other than the stuff that we had before. Come over and look at the breather. Come over and look at the carburetors. You've never seen that yet, did you? We didn't cause any damage, I don't think. Everything is so close. It's quite remarkable, really. The filters we were talking about should fit. Yeah. Perfect. It's close, but I think they'll fit. Wow. It's awesome. All right, everybody. Thanks a lot for coming back. I appreciate it. Um, you know, we got we got it on the chassis. Thanks to Nathan too, because. Sometimes he's a, a voice of good reason, and I'm, I'm not quite there yet. I'm kind of rammy sometimes, but on something like this, you don't want to be quite rammy as I am and uh, take your time, but we got it down on the chassis. Uh, basically, what's got to go on now? What's got to go on now? It's got to come back off and get painted. Maybe some wiring. What, 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 probably, some, probably fit the, probably do the brakes and all that stuff, make sure that's all situated, probably hook up the steering and that sort of stuff so I know it works. Basically, yes, yeah, that's what I should do. Yeah, we hook up the steering shaft, make sure it works. The mass brake, master cylinder and booster, you're gonna put that in there and make sure that's gonna work. Yeah, basically gonna have to build the car and then tear, tear it apart. Uh, the frame is done. Do what we're doing to the Thunderbird and then same yeah. thing here. Basically gonna have to, to get the steering hooked up, um, get everything hooked up, and then, and then go from there, I guess, and then pull back apart and paint it, because there's no sense painting anything until it fits and it works. And we don't want to be climbing over it after we paint it. So, going to be playing away, putting some stuff on it, probably put steering in it. Maybe, I'm not sure, just a, a bunch of stuff. I could list a bunch of stuff, but um, there's no sense in me listing everything, because I'm not going to know until we get at it. But, basically the same thing that what Nathan's doing to the Thunderbird right now, it needs to be completed. Have a great day, everybody. Like, comment, subscribe. Come back. Yee!